Okay, everybody, welcome to today's video. Today's video, we're going to look over some reasons why opinion seal may start to leak. This is not all reasons. This is just a few reasons, probably the more common ones. Let's get started on the video, and I'll explain to you my thoughts and my theories. As you can see, this pinion's leaking, but it's not too bad. But some of the things you got to look for, for reasons why the pinion could be leaking, is... See if there's play in the bearing. You're gonna have play like this because that's your backlash, right? So don't be alarmed like that. But if you can grab the housing and move it left and right, up and down, and there's definitely a problem with your pinion bearings, but this seems pretty solid. Backlash might be getting a little bit big. I got over 200,000 kilometers on this truck. So we're gonna pull it off for the seal and then I'm gonna inspect it further. Now we can look at the seal for some damage. Seal looks pretty reasonable, except it was full of mud inside the lip, which wouldn't help with the sealing at all. Now what I wanna do, move this washer, pull that bearing out, and let's inspect it. So looking at the rollers, they don't look too bad. What you want to look for is if there's pitting on the roller bearing itself. And the roller looks like it's in pretty decent shape still for over 200,000 K. I mean, there's definitely some wear on it, but it's not horrible. See right there, you can see where the seal's riding. So if you have a pinion seal leak that doesn't go away even after you change the seal, you may have a pretty good groove in there that allows the oil to seep through, which in that case, you either have to replace the flange or get a sleeve that'll take care of that problem. But it's not too bad, not too bad yet. Clean out the inside of that plastic ring as best as you can if this ring is busted deformed replace it i got the drive shaft inside now one of the things you want to look at going through the drive shaft to make sure everything's fine which any damage to it could cause a pinion seal leak because it'll cause vibration vibration will start to wear on that seal let's make sure the drive shaft itself doesn't have any dents cracks anything like that you want to physically feel the u-joints now this one here has got a rough spot right here. It still moves freely, but U-joints are definitely worn. I could feel a bad spot right there. This one, this one here moves good. This one here, no good. Same thing, we're gonna go to the front. The front one actually feels really good. So in the end when I was talking about pinion seal leaking in this video, I had to do some work to it anyway. So I replaced the pinion seal, did the U-joints and the drive shaft because I got over 200,000 kilometers. We pulled the pinion bearing out, had a look at it, still looked pretty good. Put it all back together. Hopefully now we won't have any issues. And if we do, we're going to have to look into something else. Everything is back together looking good. So if you guys have any questions or comments, post them below. Otherwise, I want to thank you guys for watching.